Let me show you one of my favorite equations in physics. Consider a sphere of radius r around a charge plus q. What is the flux of the electric field that is coming out of this charge through this sphere? Well, if we consider a tiny little element dA, and if we dot that with the normal, you can think of this tiny bit of perpendicular area as a vector in itself. There will be a little bit of flux of the electric field through this area. I'm going to call that d phi, which will be equal to the dot product of the electric field with that perpendicular area dA. To find the total flux through the sphere, I need to add up all those tiny contributions of flux across the sphere, meaning that I'm going to integrate. So the total flux phi will be given by the integral of E dot dA, where those two are vectors. And because I'm integrating across the sphere, which is a closed surface, I'm going to add a little circle to my integral. Luckily for us, we've got a spherical symmetry. The electric field is exactly the same across every point on the surface of this sphere. Our integral will just be equal to E multiplied by all those little areas added up that will give us the total surface area of the sphere, which is just 4 pi r squared. If only I had an equation for the electric field due to a point charge. Oh, hang on a minute. There it is. E is equal to q over 4 pi epsilon naught r squared. So I can just substitute this into this expression. We're going to get that q over 4 pi epsilon naught r squared times 4 pi r squared. And that's a lot of cancellations. What we're left with is that the flux of E will just be equal to Q over epsilon naught. And this relationship is known as Gauss's law, which is the first of the Maxwell's equations. It is true for every closed surface around the charge. Because if we had a different closed surface, all of the electric field lines will have to exit this surface. If you want to master Maxwell's equations, you absolutely need to have a look at this video in which I go over the basics of the maths that is used for them. And this video is just over here.